Hi there, this presentation will outline PhD work focusing on designing and implementing an immersive control system for a robot surrogate, with the aim of reducing isolation and improving the quality of life for patients in palliative care. Palliative care is a vital resource for patients with a terminal illness. 40, 40 million people require it each year, and only 14% receive it. This is only expected to increase with the ageing population. Palliative care patients are often at increased risk of suffering with mental health, health issues, and it has been found that they can experience helplessness, demoralisation and sometimes suicidal thoughts. Marie Curie suggests that patients may want to tackle these issues by visiting old friends, visiting significant places, taking part in favourite activities and talking to loved ones if physically able to. However, they point out that as systems, symptoms progress, things may become limited. Research into tackling isolation usually involves companion robots and rarely attempts to bring patients closer to their loved ones. There is a need for a more immersive means of communication and current telecommunication software tends to lack the high level interactions found in face-to-face -face communication. This work aims to tackle some of the problems facing palliative care patients by creating a system that will allow for remote navigation and social interaction. The system will consist of a head-mounted display which research has shown to be effective at producing feelings of presence, and a robot surrogate, which is currently a humanoid robot pepper. The system will allow users to take part in conversations and activities that they may not otherwise physically be able to do due to the symptoms of their illness, while navigating the remote environment. In addition, the surrogate will provide appropriate social cues to the users, such as people in peripheral vision, and will also use semi-autonomous gesturing to portray the personality and mood of the user, while helping to create more natural interactions for the people interacting with the robot. The hope is that this system will be able to reduce feelings of isolation and improve quality of life for the users. It will be vitally important to identify user requirements moving forward. Therefore, the next step in this PhD work is to run focus groups with palliative care patients in order to identify essential features as deemed by them. While the system is developed, it will be important to conduct user studies to not only test the technical success of the system, but also to assess the appropriateness of the features with regards to the user requirements. Towards the end of this work, this will also involve a handful of longer term case studies, which will assess whether this system could be beneficial for the intended users and help to improve the quality of life for palliative care patients. Thank you for listening and please do contact me if you have any wish to discuss this further.